my name is Markayla. If you're new and if you're returning, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today I have a hair review for you guys on this chocolate brown wig that I'm wearing. And I would like to tell you my thoughts and opinions about it. But before we do, please like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Follow me on my social medias. They're linked down below and so will this hair. So let's get started. I, I wrote down a few notes. So I tried to not forget anything, but it wouldn't be a Markayla video if I didn't forget something. Like, let's be for real. Oh, yeah. <laughs> not me forgetting what I was doing while recording a video. Anyways. <laughs> okay. I got this hair from AliExpress, and I don't know how to pronounce the name of the hair store. So I will put it right here so you guys can see it. Also, post a screenshot of what the store looks like so you know exactly where you're going when you do look for it. So that's where I got the hair. I believe it was $67. The original price was like $79. There was a coupon, you know, they'd be giving out coupons. So total, this cost me $73.72. But it was a chocolate brown 20 inch, 180% density, four by four wig so that's what it was described as on the website it has four combs is that four no i think it has three combs two on the side one in the back and two adjustable straps of course it came with a wig cap only side eye because why are you not sending me no lashes the shipping honestly i bought three wigs right and I don't know if it was the eagerness in me to get the wigs, but I feel like they took forever. And when I say forever, I mean like a week because I'm impatient. I'm so impatient. And I feel like that was a really long time, especially when you be getting your stuff off of Amazon. That's a really long time to wait because I know some of you are out there that act like me. Once you put your order in, once you press place order, you be looking out the window like, where's my order? Yeah, that's me. But in reality, it probably took like five days to get to me, which is really not that bad. I've worn this hair for, I want to say about a week and a half, maybe even longer than that. The hair does shed, but it's minimal AF. Like it barely, it's the train, excuse that. As I said, this hair does not, this hair barely sheds and I love that for me, okay? As you know before, I was trying to get this color, but when I bleached it, I did not bleach it the right way, so it came out horrendous. It came out with like a streak of brown and the rest was black, like it was not it was not looking good at all. So, when it comes to me, I I prefer to buy wigs that are pre-colored, you know, to relieve the stress off of me having to do it myself and being distressed because it's not coming out how exactly I wanted it to come out because it do be looking a mess, uh, trust me. This wig is very, 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 very soft. And it came out the package like that. I've washed this wig. I flat and ironed it like so many times. I've curled it so many times and it's still soft. I haven't put any bio silk or heat protectant in it, even though I should have but that's beside the point the point is that it's still soft after all of the trauma that i have put it through is it true to length yes so let me tell y'all i tried to do not the wolf cut but like a layered cut look and i thought it was going to turn out a different way than what it is turning out to be and looking like now so don't mind my hair I think it looked kind of cute though like I think it does look kind of cute but it's definitely not how I wanted it to come out or how I envisioned it to come out so it is true to length this was 20 inches before I cut it I promise you did it smell out of the package no it did not have that chemically chemically processy smell that most wigs have no it, it didn't smell like anything actually 180 percent density I feel like it's 160 percent density I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comments if this looks like 180% density. But to me, it just doesn't feel like it. Like, the lace melt, is that even a question? Like, be for real. Don't zoom in, but be for real. 
the lust of the wig i love it it's not too shiny not too dull like it's it's literally perfect like this is a really cute wig and i'm so happy that i purchased it because sometimes i you know like when you buy things you can you can look only look at so many reviews and most of the time the reviews are mixed to be honest with you you see girls with their hair all done up and it looks amazing and then you see other girls hair and you be like what the freak and then you look at the view reviews where they only receive where they receive like hair store hair it's it's weird but i took a chance and i really love this wig i don't remember it saying anything about pre-plucked if it did it did <laughs> if it didn't it didn't but i did not pluck this wig and i didn't wow did you hear that i did not pluck this wig and i did not bleach the knots and you see how lovely this looks like this is beautiful it blended in it melted and blended in with my skin very well after i put some makeup on it if you want to bleach the knots you can i just didn't have any powder so i didn't do that but if you want to go ahead honey okay if i had the powder i would have but i didn't have the powder anyways uh yeah so out of five stars i would give this wig i would give this wig a four out of five because it just, you didn't send me a free wig and you didn't send me any lashes whoa <laughs> Mind blowing. It's for real. I would give this a four out of five just because the density doesn't seem true to me. Uh, other than that, I really, 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 really love this wig. I feel like this is a good beginner wig for somebody who doesn't really know how to do wigs. Uh, you could make this a glueless wig if you wanted to. I feel like to give a wig a five out of five, it needs to be perfect. Like nothing is going to be perfect, but it needs to be close. I think I covered everything. If I didn't, obviously ask me down in the comments, but that was pretty much it for this video. If you guys liked it, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it anyways, give it a thumbs up because you're still here watching until I got to this part. So you might as well give it a thumbs up. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Follow me on my social medias. They will be down below as well as the link to this wig, the direct link, period. All right, guys, you be safe. I'll see you in my next video. Love you. Bye.